Hello, we're going to talk about planting caladiums today. Caladiums are one of my favorite plants to plant because they grow well in shade. I have a very shady yard and it's hard to get anything to grow that has color. Most flowers that have color like hot sun, but caladiums do not. They do best in a lot of shade. And also, um, they give you color all summer long. Their big leaves are full of color and you get to enjoy them all summer long. They don't just bloom once and that's it. So caladiums are grown from what's called a tuber or a corm, and they look like this. The bigger the tuber, the bigger the, the, the leaf is going to be. There are, they come smaller, you can get them smaller like this. I usually order mine off the internet, that way I can get the colors that I want. You can order all of one color or order mixed, however you like it. But uh, it comes with the tuber and a corm. Now, um, you plant it in your yard, they like a lot of bone meal, and um, you want to do it after all frost is gone and it takes three to six weeks for them to come up once you have planted them. Now one thing that you are going to want to do if um, you're not too scared is this bud right here that you see coming up. It looks it looks exciting because you know that you're going to get a plant there but if you will take your snips and if you'll cut off that bud it will help that have, where one leaf would have been there you're now going to have three to five leaves there and that will make a, a fuller plant for you. Now when you plant your tuber, you want to put it in the ground and cover it anywhere from two to three inches. And um, what I have done here and what I want to show you, now I plant mine in rows. Of course you can plant them in pots or however you want to do it, but I um, plant mine in rows. And I still have some pansies left over, but what I have placed in my rows here is this um, material that you um, buy from uh, for your rugs. You know how your rugs will slip on your floor and you'll put this in and it keeps them from sliding. You can buy this at um, a, clo a cloth store where you can get it by the yard or you can go to Walmart or uh, a dollar store and get it like this and I just took it and I cut it in strips and then I placed it in my furrows. Now the reason I did that is because the very first year that I planted um, caladiums in these tubers, I knew that I had to dig those tubers back up because if it freezes where you live, those tubers will rot and they won't come up the next year and then you have to purchase them all over again. In order to save them and reuse them from year to year, you need to pull them up. So I placed this fabric or this mesh in my furrow and I put my tubers on the mesh and then I cover the whole thing up with the dirt so you don't see the mesh once that you plant it. Then in the fall when it's time to pull them up and most of my leaves have died down and you can't see your tuber, all you have to do is find the end of your mesh and you know that your tubers are planted in that row. So I have to, I can pull it up or I can dig up that row and I don't accidentally end up chopping all of my tubers with my shovel. Plus, it's a lot easier on your back. So, um, that's my little secret to planting caladiums. That way you can use them from year to year to year. Put them in a box with some peat moss or some straw. Store them in your storage um, uh, bin or your garage somewhere where it's cool and dry and you'll be able to use them again the next year. Happy planting!